Hi guys. It is Friday and I am not at work because I got to go home on Wednesday. So yesterday I did nothing but sleep. I took like three naps. I slept in. I slept 11 hours. I watched a couple of Netflix movies. So yesterday was fantastic. That's my kind of day. I needed that. It was a really short week at work, but I'm just always so tired. I don't know why. So right now I'm going to drive to Chattanooga um, because my friends and I are getting a hotel for tonight and tomorrow. Uh, Matthew, who works in Jacksonville, if you guys watched my very first vlog ever, I went to go visit him in his classroom because he's a teacher. Um, so he drove up yesterday, I think. Yeah, yesterday. He left at like 5 in the morning. It was crazy. And then you guys know Julian. So he is not staying with us in the hotel because he's at school in Cleveland. It's only 30 minutes away. Oh my god. Hold on. I have a parking ticket on my windshield. Maybe it's not a parking ticket. Why would it? How did I not see that? I'm going to have to stop at the stop sign. That's embarrassing. So I legit got a ticket for facing the wrong direction. And I do face the wrong direction. I kind of had a feeling I wasn't supposed to, but it's most convenient for me in the mornings to have my driver's side closest to the sidewalk so I can lo load up my car. But I guess I can't be doing that in the future. So the game plan for this weekend is today's Friday. So tonight, tomorrow, I'm going to spend the night in the hotel in Chattanooga. And it is downtown, so I'm hoping we have good like walking distance to some places. And then... Um, so we'll check out Sunday morning, I'll come back to Nashville, and then my parents are staying in a hotel Sunday, come on, uh, Sunday night in Nashville with me before my procedure on Monday. Um, so I'll be in the hotel again Sunday night, and then have that procedure Monday, and I'm staying in my own apartment, and then I'm going to go to Memphis for work on Tuesday and stay in a hotel for Tuesday. So three different cities, three different hotels, all in one week. <laughs> this is the life of an auditor who also likes to have fun on the weekends. <laughs> supervisor two internships ago but he's the best person ever I love him so I'm gonna go see him real quick and talk to all the ladies in there I miss that office that was like the best place to work ever it just it was wonderful <laughs> so I'm driving all the way to Cleveland which is 30 miles about probably 23 miles or so north of Chattanooga and then I'm gonna come back down here downtown to check into my hotel since check-in is at 3 p.m. I can't do that early um, and then I should go to dinner with Laura. It'll be like an early dinner. And then I'll finally get to see Matthew. <laughs> but he's actually going to a, a something tonight. I don't know what it is, but some sort of event. And then I don't know what we're going to do tonight. <laughs> so I'll keep y'all posted. Okay, guys, I made it to the hotel in Chattanooga. Everything's falling apart here. So it's valley only. That was a disaster. Let me give you a tour. Here's the bathroom. Ooh, fancy. And then we got two beds. Because Matthew's staying. We are not an item. There will be no cuddling. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But not kidding. This is so pretty. Okay, let me figure this out. It's nice to stay in a hotel outside of Memphis, you know? I got this room for free because all my points. Oh my gosh, let me get you guys a view. Look at the view. Okay, it could be better, but I like it. This is nice. A lot better than what I get in Memphis. So yeah, parking was valet only. I didn't know what the heck to do. I pulled up where it said parking and I just sat there in my car. Then this guy kind of knocked on my window. And he was like, are you ready? And I was like, 
for what? He was like, you're in the valets. And I was like, oh, how do I get out of here? He said, no, it's valet only. It was just super awkward. I'm obviously don't know how to valet. Plus I have all my stuff. So I was like grabbing everything together. And then I left my keys in my car and I got out and I went to his little booth and he gave me a ticket. And he was like, where's your keys? I was like, oh, they're in the car. He was like, you left it running? <laughs> I guess you're not supposed to do that. I don't know. So I just got a Twix bar and a Dasani water for being a gold member. So that's cool. So I'm about to leave and go see my friend Laura for dinner. I'm like running so late, but had to take a moment to take in the view. <laughs> so I'm gonna go down there and figure out this whole valet situation. I don't have any money to tip them. That's so awkward. I just, I just should not do valet, but it's the only option they have. They said it's $15 a night, so I think it's on my bill. At least it should be, so I don't have to like pay it. I don't know how this stuff works. Hey, Michelle. again we know that's a struggle so I got to eat lunch with Laura or dinner or whatever you want to call it we went to Acropolis Grill in Chattanooga it was so good we talked for like an hour and a half she's taking the CPA exam so she's going through that whole process and it's all scary but she's doing good I'm so proud of her so she's like full-time studying to be an accountant CPA that's gonna be me starting in January I'm already terrified <laughs> Tourist! What's going on here? Is that my, I thought that was Michael right there. Hello? 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 Show your good side. We made it back to the hotel. I am waiting for the valet guy. I'm not sure where he's at. There's like four cars in line, which is kind of crazy. It's like midnight or something crazy like that. I don't know. Fitbit never works when you need it to work. Am I right? Am I right? It's 11, no, it's 1240 because we're on Eastern time. So we're gonna go put on some charcoal masks <laughs> and then go to bed. It's fine. <laughs> this is gonna hurt so bad. Can't feel my face. It holds. I have to peel mine off. It's all plasticky. Like 11 <laughs> or whatever time it is 10 30 10 30 brunch we're on a maple street biscuit company chattanooga it's really good so uh maple street biscuit company is a known breakfast place chattanooga it was slammed which i kind of thought it would be but i was kind of hoping it wasn't so we could eat there because matthew's never been um so now we're gonna just go to hamilton place which is kind of outside of chattanooga um it's got lots of random places we'll eat some food there i'm pretty hungry so hopefully we find somewhere and then we're gonna go watch a movie in Cleveland. I think we're gonna watch Happy Death Day. We just ate at First Watch restaurant. It's really good. We are running so late for this movie. We are still in Chattanooga. I think it's 12, it's like 12.01. The movie starts at 12.15 technically in Cleveland. So we're definitely gonna be missing all the previews, so that's good. Hopefully we still make it. We'll find out soon. <laughs> and Matthew are driving separately again. We're only like 10 minutes late. Missing the previews. <laughs> oh my gosh, traffic is stopped. Probably another wreck. 
my hair is a mess. That movie was, it was not the greatest, but I'm glad we went because I haven't been to the movie since July, I think, maybe August. And I used to go like every weekend, probably every other weekend, like not even exaggerating because I love the theater. This stupid thing won't stop buzzing. So Matthew's going to hang with his fam bam and I'm going to see Kelly. Kelly and her boyfriend Parker are going to come and chill at the hotel with me. We'll probably go out and do something if we're feeling adventurous. So I'm driving back to Chattanooga from Cleveland. It's like back and forth, back and forth. We're just totally fine. I'm just happy to be here. So we're going to Julian's concert tonight. He's singing in his choir at Lee um, for Veterans Day. But he won't tell us like what time it is or where it's at. So it's like I don't even know if he wants us to come. <laughs> it's open to the public but we don't know anything about it. I've even tried Googling it and can't find it. I'm not even convinced he's even singing tonight. So that may or may not happen. We don't know. I am still trying to get used to this valet situation. I've had a valet in my car like four or five times because I'm just like in and out. So we're not here for business or anything. We're here just to hang. <laughs> so they probably hate me. <laughs> and I don't have the nicest car, which is kind of funny because most people who do valet have really nice cars. <laughs> No idea what's going on back there. <laughs> we left dinner. How was it, guys? It was good. It's pretty, those it was good. Fries were a revelation. They were a revelation. <laughs> yes. I don't think we're here to like cause trouble. We're the youngest ones here, guys. <laughs> we're supporting the country and all the veterans. Oh, me, dog. Wait for her to die. We got us all out here going to flying squirrel. <laughs> it is so crowded. Julian, you need to watch them. <laughs> Julian! Julian doesn't watch my vlogs. It is midnight 30. We are at our hotel here downtown. And I am so tired and so is Matthew. So we are going to crash as soon as we get in there. Long day, but an amazing day with friends. So thankful. So thankful. <laughs> it feels so nice out here. It was so much colder earlier. We're about to leave our hotel room. Matthew has to drive like seven hours today. Mine's only two. <laughs> what? We're not ratchet. I love this mirror though. Don't want to leave. It's been so good and so fun. Hey guys, I just left Matthew. So he's headed to Florida to go back to teaching. I'm headed to Nashville. This weekend was so amazing. It's such a good break from work. It was basically like a fall break that I've missed in college. It was really awesome. So I'm so glad we were able to all hang out. And our friends Michael and Hannah came with us last night. And then my girl Kelly and Parker. Her boyfriend Parker. <laughs> I'm so glad they hung out with us too. It was a lot of fun. So now I'm headed back to Nashville. And then tonight... I'll actually be staying in a hotel in Nashville with my parents because tomorrow morning is my procedure, my EGD thing. I am like really nervous, but it's going to be okay. It's a really simple procedure. <laughs> I'm like working myself up over nothing. So it'll be fine. It'll be good. Oh, I hope so at least. We'll see. Sunday at like 4.30. 5.30. No, it is 4.30. No, I think it's 5.30. And my parents are about to be here at 5, so it must be 4.30 um, to go get me. We're going to hang out at their hotel in um, downtown Nashville. I think they're staying in Broadway. 
So we're gonna do that for tonight, and then my hospital appointment is at 7.30 in the morning in West Nashville, so they're gonna drive over. They haven't checked in the hotel or anything yet, but they're gonna come get me. They're on the way from home. So that's what's going on. I packed a bag. <laughs> Hopefully I didn't forget anything. I literally have been in a hotel in East Tennessee with Chattanooga for two nights, and then now in Middle Tennessee for tonight, and then I'm gonna be in West Tennessee in Memphis for the week, so all over the place <laughs> but once again travel job and someone who likes to have fun that's what you do to go to the hospital and have my EGD scope done. I'm a nervous wreck. I woke up at 3.30 was up until I think 5.30, like freaking out. Typical me, it's not even a big deal at all. I've had three surgeries before. We've been through this. This won't be as bad as any of those. <laughs> I don't even think there's like after effects. They just said my stomach may be swollen. It'll be fine. I'll be good. <sighs> I just can't eat or drink and I'm kind of hungry because I've been up for a while. But it's going to be okay. It'll be over before I know it. Mom and Dad are downstairs enjoying a breakfast. I'm going to come up here or come down there and bring all my stuff when they're done. And then we're going to go. The parents just left. So I'm back from the hospital. Everything went well. It took me a while to, to feel normal after that anesthesia. But I'm such a lightweight, and that medicine takes me forever. Every surgery I've had. But all is well. So I'm probably just going to take a nap. I didn't sleep well last night, plus I'm, I'm sleepy from everything. And watch some TV and relax. Pack for Memphis later. And take off at 6 in the morning. For week number 10. <laughs> it's Tuesday morning at about 6 something. Probably 6.30 by now. I don't know. 6.33. I'm headed to Memphis. This is my 10th week. I guess I'll close the vlog out here since I'm just headed to work. Same old, same old. So thank you guys for watching Heaven's Odd Venture. And I will see y'all next time. Someone else was laying there. I was like, oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> so I closed the curtain. <laughs>